Hi there. If you're a real estate agent, you know how hard it is to manage all the moving parts of your business. I've been in real estate for a few years now, and I needed to find a tool where I could organize all parts of my life and business in one place. So when I found this app called Notion, it was a game changer. And I can't wait to share with you guys my setup today. This is my home dashboard, which is what I'm going to share with you guys on this video. So basically, this includes all of 13 dashboards here. So my, my, my main home hub contains 13 dashboards. And here they are. So you've got my CRMs, my transaction manager, my social media content planner, my task manager, my business operations, uh, an expense tracker, a goal tracker, habit tracker, reading tracker, brain dump, digital Rolodex, a testimonial manager, and a help section. And then on my homepage, also, I have a little calendar. I have today's follow-ups, so all the people that I need to get in touch with today. My tasks for the day, anything that's due in the next seven days. My daily habits to make sure that I have everything checked during the day. And my active listings. So these are the things that I want to have um, a close eye on every day that I can quickly look at and see what my day is looking like. So just to give you an example here, this is really connected to my CRMs. So to my buyer CRM and to my seller CRM. So when I make a change in here, this will automatically go in the buyer CRM or the seller CRM database. So let's say it's the start of my day, I'm doing my follow-up calls, and I want to contact Dwayne Johnson, The Rock. And so <laughs> I'm going to open up his profile here, and then I'm going to look at what are the last notes. So now this will um, add a little date here. I have a list of action items for buyers. I have the same thing for sellers. And um, these are the usual steps that we have with the buyers. So, so these are just general outlines of the steps with a buyer, but obviously you can personalize this and change these for your own, uh, for your own setup and your own systems. So there we go. And then next follow-up will be, these are the wrong dates, but let's say um, today's the 24th. So I want to follow up with him in one week. So next follow-up will be December 1st. I close that up. So he has disappeared from today's follow-ups and he will reappear again next Friday, next December 1st, when I need to follow up with him again. So that's how this works. Um, pretty straightforward. I'll go into the other dashboards in separate videos. So this entire template is available. I've dropped the link down below if you'd like to check it out. My name is Jessica and I'll see you in the next video.